The suspect in this case, 38-year-old Justin Judge, lives with his parents here in Port Orange because he has medical issues. His father told me he had no idea Judge even had a laser until police arrived. We're being hit by a laser. Using the chopper's night vision camera, the pilot could see the suspect on the ground. And though you can't see the beam when the camera is on infrared, the pilot was briefly blinded by a blue and color laser. When we first got hit, we zeroed out this general area, and then when we came back around, he was standing under the large tree. The pilot reported the suspect actually shined the laser at the chopper twice. It was a surprise to me. The suspect's father said he was asleep when police arrived and arrested his son, who was taken to the hospital rather than jail because the son was having trouble breathing. Tim Judge says his son told him where police would find the laser, allegedly admitting what he did. If I had known that he had it, of course, I'd say, you know, get rid of it. It surprised me that he would do something like that. Shining a laser light at pilots, motorists, it's a felony because it can cause someone to lose control. Police recovered the laser and reassured Air One. Hopefully won't get any more lasers at you tonight. Investigators say there have been three other instances of someone pointing a laser at a sheriff's helicopter in the same general area this month, but in those cases, no one could be found when police responded. In Port Orange, Volusia County, Claire Metz, West 2 News.